What's up YouTube? We're back with another hockey card opening video. Please subscribe, like the video, that good stuff. Give me some comments, I love them things. Just on to react to everybody, even the trolls. Let's see what we get out of here. Some hockey. Go Golden Knights. Went to college in Reno, Nevada. So I love to see Young Guns and the Vegas Golden Knights win the Stanley Cup finally. They've been doing good, you know, they've only been around a few years, but they've been doing good, so they they deserve it. And I would like to see it. You know, my Dallas Stars can't win it too. Because I live in Texas now. Got to got to have where I went to college, Nevada win. Alright, rookie class, Golden Knight, Peyton. Ribs. What, what I do? Oh. I don't know. Keep my sleeves moving them. My piles go on the right, sleeves go on the left. All mixed up. I like these um, rookie class cards. I think they're cool, but they don't get as much love, of course, as the young guns. The young guns they get all the love. That's what everybody wants for the hockey rookies. It's crazy. Like sometimes I'll see young guns like selling for more than, but like. The variation, short print, like low numbered type stuff goes for people just want them playing young guns. Mitch Marner. But it's like that in all sports, really. Like sometimes I'll see like a prism autograph go for like 200, but then like the prism silver <laughs> goes for like 500. <laughs> and you're like, what? Like, wouldn't you rather have the player's autograph and it be like short printed? And <laughs> no, I just want to. Mass population silver card rookie. That's just that's where the the demand is, so that's where the the money goes, I guess. But that's good for me because I like I'd rather have the autographs. Nobody wants like their relics though, unless it's a logo man. Which is funny because like the logos were cool when they came out, but, and the swatches and laundry tags and swooshes, all that stuff. But like. $30,000 and stuff when people are paying for this stuff. It's just ridiculous. Thomas Harley. It used to be like 100 to 500 on like crazy stuff like that. And now it's like 30 grand, 20 grand, 15 grand, depending on the player. I don't know. Too many rich people getting into this. Makes me sad though, because like I had a Tom Brady Bowman Chrome Refractor rookie card in like mint condition. What happened to this pack? I sold that thing in like 2007. It's like 50, 55 bucks, something like that. And you know, that was pretty good back then. I just saw a BGS 9 of that same card sell for $36,000. Crazy. Dwelling on that makes you want to kill yourself. <laughs> sad, sad, sad. But it even happens with, um, like recently, like in 2021, I pulled a Steph Curry, I think it was National Treasures, like autograph out of like 15 or something and I sold it for the car prices are going crazy so I, I put like a hundred thousand dollars more best offer and put it on eBay and I only got one offer in like three weeks for 300 bucks and then I countered the guy and was like dude can you do any better than that and he offered me 500 which was what they were kind of selling for at the time so I just took it and then a couple of years later, now that thing's selling for thousands of dollars. Oh my gosh. Craziness. Craziness, craziness. It's, patience is a virtue, I guess, which I do not have. Hey, Kiliev, Arthur Kiliev. For the polls, likes that, that guy and that team for some reason. Oh, 
Quentin Byfield, but I am the master of the Quentin Byfield cheese. I have, I think I'm up to 216 Quentin Byfield cheese cards now from Metal Universe. I want to get it to like 300. Here's a Golden Knight. Just leave the shinies. I'm gonna open all these. Just gonna keep it going. These were cheap. Um, I, I'm sure you can get them cheaper. There's a Kopitar. Hey, there's a Retro Rookie Foot. Um, you can get them cheap on some of the websites. Dave and, not Dave and Busters, Dave and Adams. <laughs> and things like that. But um, I got two of these retail boxes shipped to me for like 40 bucks or something. Real, real cheap. You buy any other series or year or whatever of upper deck hockey and it's like way more money but i guess this this one was like mass mass printed or something so it's super cheap but there's some really good stuff in here still got some good stuff in here pretty easy to get your money back and you're only spending twenty dollars on a box just get the right young gun or something and you're good something short printed or something Base. Hobby is better, I guess, because you get something in every pack. Retail, you can get base packs, but that's okay. There's still some goodies to be had. Oh, 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 oh. Dallas Stars jersey is dope. Hey, Isla Sazorkin? Sazorkin? Something like that. I'm not sure how to say it. I love the ovations. Upper deck ovations, the dope set back in the day. Football. Probably hockey too. But I don't know, I didn't collect hockey back then. The younger, strictly football. Anything else? No, I wasn't having it. It was weak. Everything was weak but football. <laughs> but now I've learned to like and appreciate most everything. Sports cards. Ole, 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 roly poly, ole. This is a good TV show. Watch that as a kid. <laughs> to Chuck, oh, Alexander Romanoff. Dazzlers, I love me the Dazzlers, man. Dazzlers are so dope. Oh, this is probably just a base card, but I like it. Boom. Dazzle me, baby. Dazzle me. First box almost done. Sent a couple packs to some people and. Open one for a short, so it's not quite a full one box, but close to it. We'll get into box number two. What's going on with these sleepy poos? Sleepy poo. That's it. Hey, look at that one. Retro Logan. I'm slow today, just leaving it, trying to enjoy my my opening here. I usually try to go quick, but because I got so much to do, but I really don't have a whole lot to open right now. So, anybody who wants to do like package slots or send me stuff or whatever, just hit me up on Instagram or my email in the about section. I'll work something out. I'm searching for new content. For a while it was like, I'm just gonna open everything I've never opened until I've opened like everything in the world that I can afford, you know? Of course not like flawless and national treasures and stuff, but maybe one day if I ever get monetized, I can afford to do something like that. But right now, nah. Hey, 
I even I don't even like spending a hundred dollars on a box to be honest with you. Cheaper the better. Down to spend like twenty bucks on a box though. <laughs> Sharks jersey. Hey, there's a young gun for the Florida Panthers. Who are not going to win the Stanley Cup. <laughs> not this year. Golden Knights are killing them. And everybody, everybody was telling me, oh, no, the Panthers, man, they're so tough. They're so rough. They're, they're so good. You know, they're young and talented. And Panthers, man. Panthers, Panthers. Ryan Getzlaff. Um, everybody was saying the Panther. I didn't have one person say the Golden Knights. And I think it's because they're new, you know. People just don't think it's going to happen. And it's happening. <laughs> but I was, I was telling everybody, I was posting everywhere. I was like, Golden Knights in five. <laughs> it's not even going to be close. Golden Knights in five. <laughs> I think they're looking pretty good right now. So I might be right. That's all right. They win. I don't. I don't care. The Panthers can win next year. I don't care who wins next year. And just I don't care who wins in the next ten years. As long as the Golden Knights win this year, I'll be happy. <laughs> my, my Golden Knights got one. My Dallas Stars have won before. So there's a McDavid at a 350. I guess that's like a orange variation. A little, a little bit more orangish than I think these are normally like a reddish color. Let's see. Do I have it? Or no? No, I'm, I'm way off. Yeah. So that's no. Those both look the same. Just uh, instead of the mirrored background, it's like an actual background of the rink. Yes. Huh. That's dope though. Short print McDavid. That'll pay for one of the boxes most likely. Penguin jersey. He wins. My dad's team. Steelers too. My dad loves the Pittsburgh teams. I don't know why. He's never lived there. <laughs> it's just latched onto him, I guess. Being in Alaska, you gotta latch onto somebody. A lot of people in Alaska like California teams, 49ers and whatnot. But not me. I went for America's team. Down in Texas. And I finally lived in some states where now I live in Texas and I lived in Nevada. So some states that actually have professional sports. Marky Mark Ovech Ovation <laughs> Ovechkin Ovation uh. All right. Victory Hey, there's a regular Ovechkin Dazzle me, baby. Dazzle me. I like the, the green dazzlers the best, but I feel like I missed something. Probably did. Did I? I don't know. Kopitar. Go back through my pile, see if I missed anything. 
I always mess it up when I'm not paying attention. I'm not talking. I'm going on autopilot. Almost done. Got a half a box left. Hey, another retro Ichiro. Come on, here we go. <laughs> Here's another checklist, David. Cool, cool, cool. All right, last half box mojo time. Dazzle me. Hey, a youngie. Ooh, youngie gun. Knock over some piles here. Ooh. Leon. Drysdale, is it? Something like that. Alexander Barnabov. Barnabov? <laughs> struggling. But I watch a lot of hockey videos now, so the names are starting to come to me. Some of them, anyway. The ones I should know. <laughs> Cal Foot. Lightning. Shiny, shiny, hollow. Well, I'm happy with that one numbered card. That's pretty good. Hey, Austin Strand, young gun. Ooh, shiny, shiny, shiny. Maple Leafs, Nick Robertson. Last three pack mojo time. All right. Second to last pack mojo time. The maple leaves. Last pack mojo time. Last pack mojo is my worst mojo usually. At least dazzle me, baby. Just a regular young gun. Flip through what I sleeved. Boom, boom. Checklist. Dazzlers. I think the Ovechkin was the best card, probably. Out of 350 there. 201 out of 350. I don't know. Let me know in the comments who you think was the best hit. I'm still trying to trying to learn the hockeys. The sticks. Mark Stone retro. Alright y'all, peace.
Peace.